Hey guys, welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. And Link is falling asleep on a chair. <laughs> uh, we're doing some side stuff currently, and I'm here at the Lumpy Pumpkin, is it? What is it? The Lumpy Pumpkin. Wow. If I can't remember that name, then I definitely must be tired this morning. Yeah, I just woke up like 10 minutes ago. But anyways, let's get some side stuff done. What do you got for us? Oh, you're here just in time. Just in time for another job, that is. And this job is to help pick the pumpkins. I don't want to hear you moan and complain. Fine. Should be easy one for you. Blah, 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 blah. Kina. Yeah, let's go see Kina. There's no telling what will happen on the night. Hmm, interesting. I might have to come back here once in a while at night. Or not. Actually, there's nothing happening during the night. There's one thing here we can get at night, though. But, yeah. We'll do that after, probably. Hi. Oh, and your next job has been decided. Looks like you'll be helping with pumpkin harvest. Really, if you don't. Any idea? Have those Oh, man. That's this minigame, isn't it? Ah, shit. Yeah, you have to carry like five pumpkins at once. Which is extremely annoying to do. And what the hell is up with my mic? Hello. There we go. Sorry, I hope I didn't blow anyone's ears out. Apparently my mic settings reset. That's weird. So yeah, you have to carry five pumpkins from here to the storage shed. And it's extremely annoying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here we go. This is what you have to do. You have to move extremely slow. And you have to make sure you balance these things. So hopefully I won't fail too much at this. Yeah. You pretty much have to move all the way back and forth. Yeah, man. This is the annoying part. You want to move to one side, but you can't. Because the pumpkins are falling to the right. You want to move to the left. Or the other way. No. Left and right, that's right. <laughs> uh, I should record, really, when I'm this tired. And yeah, I actually got planned for what I'm going to do in the video this time. Oh shit. Come on. We made it! Holy crap! I hate that thing. It's one of the worst things in the game to do. But trust me, there's something worse than wolving pumpkins. Yeah, managed to carry them all. Thank you very much. Uh, is that it? Let's go in and talk to the dude again. Let's see if that was it. I was hoping for something, you know. So what this guy's got to say. Impressive! Give me some time. Alright, so we gotta come back here later. But yeah, I think there's a gratitude crystal I can get here. Actually. So I'm gonna go have a look around. Sleepy time, Link. Alright, let's have a look. There should be one here somewhere. I think it's upstairs actually. Yeah. Come on. Oh, I just have to go to the other side. Excuse me, princess. Gotta love that shit. 26 gratitude crystals. I think we need more progress progress in the story, to be honest, before we can get anything else. Uh, well, we are gonna progress the story pretty soon, but there's one more thing I wanna do first, and that's collect some chests that I haven't done yet, and we got a few of those to collect. Let's see. Let me go outside and bring up my map, and I'll show you.
As you can see, we got quite a few. There's a few others that is unlocked, but we can't get them yet. So, I'm gonna meet you. I'm gonna cut and meet you on this island right here. So, I'll see you then. And we are back in free fall. This island is actually quite special. There's a mini game actually on this island. It's not something you have to do to get 100% this mini game, but I'm gonna show it off anyway. Yes, I do believe you can get a lot of rupees here. Speaking of rupees, we got a gold rupee. It's worth 300 rupees. Holy crap! Yeah, you definitely don't want to pass that up. Alright, let's go inside here. This is the minigame. I've never done this before, I've only seen it on videos. Where is this place? It says my secret spot. I come there to work the king's side of my sword arm. <laughs> I should do that, mine suck. I was the most popular guy in all Skyloft. Blah blah blah. Yeah, so this guy is kinda complaining about how his life is gone. Sure, we'll slice some bamboo. That's the spirit. Chop away, boy. I'm going to take a swing in, putting down that old big bamboo in the middle of the room. The thing is, it's a count to see how many cuts you can get before you hit the ground. If you get enough, throw out, win a prize. Yeah, you get a prize if you do it enough. But uh, I can't remember what it is. Alright, so. This is pretty much all you want to do. Damn it! Yeah. I messed up a bit there. 14 times. It's not bad, though. 14. Oh, I was one cut off. Alright, I'm gonna try it again to see if I can actually get 15. Yes, I want to see what the price is. I want to do it now. Give me another chance. I'm in. See if we can get 15. Damn it! I keep. Come on. Yeah! That's how you do it! 27 times! I thought I fucked it up there. Holy crap. Well, son, you're all done. Let's count the cats. Score time is 27. Oh, we that's a new record. Way to go, kid. We that's what I'm talking about. You brutalized that bamboo, boy. Here's a prize. Oh, yeah. That's true. You get, like, a random crafting material from this place and we got an evil crystal and I think that's the first one we ever gotten which is awesome man I don't have a lot of crafting materials yeah if you do 28 next time it'll only give you another random crafting material I probably won't be doing this a lot because random crafting materials is just a gamble and gambles are really not what I'm good at trust me alright let's see what do we got? We got this, this, and this to collect. Is it two trees chest now? And then we got the one over here as well. Alright, so let's get to it. I might as well not cut to this one because the more cutting I have to do, the more work. And for those of you who don't know, I'm an extremely lazy person. <laughs> How's everyone been doing lately? Anyway, I haven't uploaded in a few days or recorded anything, so because I've been enjoying the sun. It's been awesome here the last few days. Extremely hot and sunny. Everyone loves the hot and sunny weather. But today it's kind of grey, so yeah, it's not very fun. I'm taking the time to record, not just because it's bad weather, but because I really needed to record. I haven't recorded Skyward Sword in days, and the last video I put up was pretty boring. Holy crap, we got a hundred rupees! 
racking in that money. We're gonna have to go spend some pretty soon, let's we'll see. No, not that button. Uh, we can only carry up to 900 rupees. I might as well go spend something now. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that, so... I'll be right back at Sky the Skyloft. And we're back in the Skyloft. And let's see if we can find Beetle. Because if you wanna if you wanna use money, the best person to find is Beetle. <laughs> Definitely. He does have the most expensive thi items in the game, so... Grab him! I think he got an adventure power checking by, but... I don't know. We'll see! Let's have a look. Yeah, he's got an adventure pouch. Let's see how much, though. Six hundred rupees. Uh, we'll buy it. Yeah, these get a lot more expensive. I can't. I think the last one is like twelve hundred. I'll have a look. Actually, no. I won't have a look now. I'll come back later. Cause okay, so I want to get back to those chests. So, I will meet you back at the next chest. I was gonna get, so I'll see you then. And we're back again, and I just face planted on the thing. Yeah, this is Beatles Island. The one he goes to at night, and it's just chest on top of the thing. With the heart piece! Awesome! And we got another heart container from that, so even more awesome. Yeah, we need more of those heart containers. Let's see, is there another chest in here? I can't remember if I've activated this one or not. No, I haven't, so I don't have to bother with this one yet. Yeah, this one is a pain in the ass to get. Alright, so let's go to the next one. Should be the one quite close to here, actually. Yeah, there's one. The small island down there. Dive, dive, dive! Who's that guy? I think he's so good. I think, is this the one with two on it? I can't remember. Let's see. No. Click that one off. And this one. Yeah, this says, it says it's two on this one. I'll have to have a look. Yeah, there's one down here. Yeah, here's one, and I think there's another one, but I'm not quite sure. So what we got? Oh, we got a treasure medal! Carry this with you, the treasure will appear more often. I'm definitely bringing that with me. Is that already in my adventure pouch? Yes, it is. Yeah, you'd want to bring those with you. Trust me. Yes, those are extremely useful. Let's see. Oh yeah, down here. Uh, right? I think. Oh, I see one over there. Well, let's bomb out, bomb out the wall. Maybe that's it. <laughs> Boom! There you go. That was the other one I was thinking of. Alright, let's see what we got. What we got. Ooh, another silver rupee. Awesome! Alright. So, let's have a look. 
Alright, so that's the only one we're missing. Alright, so I will meet you meet you on the other side where that treasure chest is, so I'll see you then. Alright, we're back. Free falling once again. Until this weird little island here. Here we go, here's the last guy, this chest I'm gonna collect for a while. And we got a heart medal! Yeah, these are actually important to get for 100%. They actually count towards your total heart pe hearts. You won't be able to get 20 hearts without these heart medals, so... And of course, Bill has a couple of them. Which is extremely expensive. But yeah. So now we can take this one off. There's one in Skyloft, but you can't get that yet. And there's a few inside here, but that's for later. Yeah, spoilers you get inside there. <laughs> but anyways, I think that's enough side stuff for now. I'm gonna cut the video he around here probably. And next time we're gonna be doing the story. I'm just gonna keep recording.